Kirill Khoroshenkov and I'm professor of acoustics uh, at uh, the University of Sheffield. Well, acoustics has uh, anything to do with the generation, uh, manipulation, uh, the uh, transmission and uh, recording of sound. Almost every single individual has one of those things. And this is basically acoustics because it has a microphone and the speakers and a complicated audio processing system. And that requires a lot of knowledge of acoustics to make sure that people you talk to hear you and you hear people to talk to you. But also uh, it underpins more important things, for example, uh, defense and security of this nation. And in terms of um, healthcare, ultrasonic scans, and the quality of manufacturing in terms of the non-destructive evaluation and testing. And also in terms of the quality of life, like a nice environment with low noise and good uh, speech eligibility or good performance spaces, or comfortable motor cars and uh, transport like trains or planes. So before I got into acoustics, I didn't even know what acoustics was. Um, and by coming into this field, I'm more aware of the different applications. I didn't know that acoustics could be used in medical devices, you know, in space and aircraft, machinery, just, just the vast, um, you know, applications that there are. So I look at vibrations and acoustics of pipework. Um, so that could be in, in industry, in, in large buildings. And, and that's good because um, I can do my testing in the lab and I can upscale it and, and see how it's effective you know, outside. So we use different technologies, um, one being oralization, where we can hear what acoustic environments are going to sound like before they are made in real life. So we can listen to buildings or high-speed rail, for example. Why did I get into acoustics? Um, well, it had a good balance of chemistry, which is what I was interested in, and I could really see a real-life application with what I wanted to study. I noticed that with chemistry, it was very much in the lab, and it just stayed there, um, whereas with acoustics and, and just mainly engineering, I got to go out there and use it for a real-life application, and that's what interested me. So there's so many careers you can follow through with the acoustics as a basic training. Every single industry um, requires specialists in acoustics, whether it's uh, medical engineering or the uh, manufacturing uh, or defense uh, or the building. So these specialists are in very high demands and there's just not enough of them. So it's a very good career choice, which is reasonably well paid. Currently in the UK, uh, we've got 16,000 people actively employed in acoustics, and this number is growing. And um, these careers are very exciting in terms of the uh, opportunities to develop professionally and the quality of the job. Um, I mean, in water networks,